Hello everyone. Batteries are everywhere. In our toys, cars, torches and mobile phones. And today's episode, we'll be making your own battery using lemon. FYI guys, we're not going to use the lemon to power up a toy today. What I am going to show you is that if we are going to be able to squeeze an electricity out of a single lemon. And here are what you're going to need to to do in this experiment. A lemon. That's right. A galvanized nail. Or something as or something like this as long as it galvanized a five centimeter of copper wire to binder clips and a voltmeter so let's get into it first thing you're gonna need to do Give your lemon a few strong squeezes. Daddy, can you please help me? I'm not that strong, really. Be careful not to break its skin. What are you going to do next is place the copper wire in the lemon. Can you do it? Like this? Yeah, can you do it? Or do you want me to help you do this? I want you to help me. And I can't look. Mm. Done? Next is place the galvanized nail in the lemon. Approximately two centimeter away from the wire. Okay, can't look at this again though. Last but not least. Test it with a voltmeter. Connect the red test lead to the nail, which is this one. And you need to also use a paper clip, a binder clip, I mean. I get confused with paper clip and binder clip. Can you hold the lemon, clip. please? Hold the lemon. And and black lead to the copper wire with binder clips. And as soon you will find a reading of an electricity. But first you had to turn it on. Two, twenty, and soon you will find a reading of an electricity out of your lemon battery. As you can see here, it the battery says zero points ninety two or ninety three, ninety two volts. There you are, guys. Congratulations in making your first ever lemon battery. Here is your fun fact. So lemon battery works through an electrochemical reaction. When in a complete circuit, the citric acid in the lemon acts as an electrolyte, a solution that conducts electricity. Just like the sulfuric acid in the a lead acid battery and a car battery is a great example of 
a lead acid battery. That's about everything in our lemon battery. I hope that you're uh, not planning to make it further just to run your mom's car out of lemon battery. Otherwise, you're going to need truckloads of lemons. Imagine a car running down the road, pulling a trailer with lots of lemons. Copper wire and galvanized nails. Till next time, as always, thanks for watching. And make and making a lemon battery for our Saturday science experiment. Bye.